You're watching From the Heart with John Willard. Hi, friends. John Willard here. A really good show today about unsung heroes. And remember the subscribe button below for CNA TV. Life is now in session. Enlarge my heart with a story and change me by the characters I meet there. Oh, the Ozarks. There is no place on earth to match this area. Crystal springs by the hundreds and even more caves. The Ozarks are sights, sounds, and scenery. Boyhood home of Nagi and Naka. Friends, the heroes in my life and in my heart. Once in a while, a person touches our lives with words and actions so special that they change us forever. Heroes teach us the benefits of persistence and commitment. Heroes personify the best of what we believe about ourselves and offer proof that our grandest goals are achievable. Often, these are unsung heroes. There is something in our spirit that longs to be elevated to new heights of purpose. Extraordinary achievements never fail to inspire us to raise our own sights and to color outside the lines. The celebration of heroes, we discover, is ultimately the celebration of our own potential. Qualities of sacrifice and virtue in your own heart is a hero of epic proportion. The satisfaction of a life of purpose pursued with courage and passion. This life of purpose I see in Naka, Nagi, and Nagi's mom. Sometimes something hits people between the eyes. Nagi's upstairs bedroom was cold on winter nights when the loud cursing and fighting would get unbearable for Nagi. He would sneak down those stairs, go out to the barn, lay in the hay next to Dan, his hound dog. Look at the night stars. Oh, they seem close enough to touch. It didn't dawn on him to be afraid of the dark. Not as long as Dan was there. When the fighting had stopped, Nagi's mom would come out there and walk him back to the house. She would hold his hand, told him to listen for the birds, and told him their names. Nagi's mom must have piled a half a dozen quilts on him. <laughs> the weight of them held him snugly. He breathed through a tiny opening and could feel the cold air on his face while the rest of him stayed warm. Nagi's mom would say, our adversities make us strong. Our victories make us wise. Our actions make us proud. She was his hero. She prepared surpassed what would be expected. She never failed to inspire him to dream bigger, reach higher, and endure longer. Too often, we underestimate the power 
of touch, a smile, a kind word, a listening ear, or the smallest act of caring, all of which have the potential to turn a life around. And since Nagi's mom, a Naka contributor, turned many lives around, I wrote this poem in honor of her. A mother's love, let me share. Mothers are forever, they never seem to bend a timeless bond of love and hope on which we all depend. They provide a place to which we flee when the world grows cold and dreary. To be secure and find a hug when we have grown too weary. To build us up when we are scared and help us bear the pain, then give us strength to stand alone and venture out again. A mother is like a rainbow made up of different members. And unless each works together, it will fade like a fire's embers. The yellow stands for happiness that warms us deep inside. The blue is there in all our sorrow that we may try to hide. The gray is death and better endings that wrench our tender souls, but green brings new growth to take their place and once more make us whole. Mother's ties provide unending strength, just like rainbow colors from above. And through time, support and caring, mothers make us rich and radiant with love. Friends, Nagi's mom, a Naka contributor, took Nagi and went through fear and came out the other side. You gain strength and courage by looking fear in the face, by saying, I live through this horror and I can take the next thing that comes. Fear is in your mind and your mind can be changed. Friends, let me share this short quote with you. Just remember that it's true. It takes rain to make rainbows, lemons to make lemonade. And sometimes it takes difficulties to make us stronger and better people. Though you cannot go back and make a brand new start, Anyone can start from now and make a brand new end. Many things will catch your eye, but only a few will catch your heart. Pursue those. You can reach me on Twitter at John Willard 47. This is John Willard from the farm.